600 subscribers. And I like pistachio ice cream. Making a note on number 600. And as I digest the Starbucks here, satanic Starbucks. listening to a talk with Jordan Peterson and something that struck me was it struck me it, de it devastated me <laughs> it struck me that uh, got my attention was um, not wanting to do anything and that that would be uh, depressing or a state of depression and I thought wait a minute Because uh, even when I've uh, calculated my size when compared to the to a, a built to the world's tallest building, that building to the size of the Earth, to the size of the Earth, to the uh, solar system it's in, the solar system within the galaxy and the galaxy within the universe and then the universe within the outer verse that it's blowing up into, expanding into. Uh, no, I'm, I'm not going to get this pencil and be like, ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> fuck all that. What does it all mean? No. But I, I am saying that, uh, this piece and uh, re really my collection of work, what I've done in life, doesn't really amount to a hill of, be to a hill of beans in the on the scale of the universe. Oh, does that mean, man, you're gonna quit and just shoot up heroin and fucking start beheading and raping motherfuckers left and right? No. Oh man, you're gonna jump off a bridge? No. No, I'm just uh, um, accepting the, uh, the the scale of things. That's it. I'm not uh, I'm not fucking breaking down and saying, "Oh, <laughs> what does that all mean?" Anyways, I'm thinking, you know, it's temporary. This life is temporary, but through the system of capitalism. She used darker stuff like that. Through the uh, system of capitalism, there are rewards, benefits, pleasures, orgasms, relationships, moments that uh, man, can be wonderful, man. And I've, I've got to work on this moment to this second for the minutes to add up to the hours so that those things happen and I'm, I'm not gonna let you motherfuckers be like well how do you draw this how do you draw that how do I get better you're so lucky no fucker <laughs> if I really want to get into a negative state of mind I could just snap this fucking pencil I don't love people over this place and say, you know what, fuck this shit, man, I'm tired of, I'm tired of putting in all these hours, y'all niggas don't give me money, nah, man, I deserve a nicer car, a nicer place to live, a nicer this, a nicer that, I'm being oppressed, this hurts me, uh, my feelings, blah, 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 and, and shit like that, and, and there are people like that, nah, man, fuck this, man, I'm tired of being poor, let me take this niggas chains, niggas, lunch money, Paycheck, fucking uh, whatever the fuck I can snatch with them for me, because me, I am number one. And um, I don't get that, man. I, I don't. Uh, I don't get that. And 
and I, and I keep on thinking. Of, of what is right, and that's why I say, I, and I like pistachio ice cream because I could be butthurt, sad, happy, depressed, busting a nut, um, full or hungry without um, money in my wallet or a fucking huge paycheck along the way. And I could um, say, no matter what, I would like pistachio ice cream. No, it doesn't mean I have it. doesn't mean it's on the way. doesn't mean fucking it's number one. It's the greatest thing in my life. It gives me comfort. It's going to fix my butthole. It's going to fucking mend my heart. It's going to save the world. It's going to bring world peace. And... Because there's, there's some sort of constant here. Um, because I still think that there, <clears throat> a lot of people give you this um, this sort of uh, delivery of words, presentation of of the words or of themselves that tells you, "Look at me, I am normal. You're the one that's fucked up." Let's focus on your problems, because obviously, I got it all together. You should listen to me. I'm number one, but here, man, give me your money, your attention, your friendship, your home, your lunch money, your this, your that. And the people that are so weak, they'll say, yeah, you know what? This person is smiley, and they're telling me that they're saying the truth. So, yes, I believe them. I'm getting lost in my train of thought right now. Um, because I like uh, Dr. Jordan Big Dick Pepison. <laughs> Remember when I uh, had read that? I thought, you know what, that's a, a good name right there. So many people, with him disagreeing, um, with Canada's law of uh, addressing people by whatever sex identity, Cybertron, Megatron, Decepticon that they identify as, as law. Or else you could be charged with uh, hate speech in Canada. At, at, and or something like that. I forget the fucking law, but... Um, what if uh, Dr. Peterson had wanted that title to be called Dr. Jordan Big Dick Bepison? Or Pepe the Frog. But, you know, some people say, well, no, that's sexist, that's uh, sex, uh, sexist, that's um, sexual assault, because you're talking about big dick, that means he just sexually assaulted me. You know, it's an attack on, on homos, because they're thinking about dick, oh, no, it's um, Pepe Sin, the hate symbol, <laughs> third right, fourth right, you're Satan, leave me alone. And I'm listening to uh, listening to a lecture, not a lecture, an interview, an Australian interview with uh, Dr. Peterson on his YouTube channel right now, and it's uh, it's refreshing, man. And I'll attempt to break it down my way, the, the way that I see it. Um, I don't know how you will see it. I got no fucking idea, and. But I believe if it makes you think and say, hey, you know what, do I, do I, just, just like a look at this piece here, I'm thinking, does the darker red dissolve evenly here, or can I add a little bit more, I think just a little bit more, you know, is that the most effective way of uh, representing the, um, um, the shade or the look? But when you hear Dr. Peterson to say or think, you know what, is this the most effective way of me being? 
because so many of us, I remember as a kid uh, thinking, you know, is this project, is this the school project, will the teacher like me, is this the best, will, will, I, will I look like a fool, will more people like me, are, are these the right shoes to wear, are these, is this the hip shirt, and we, we major, we focus majorly on our, our little stupid shit, but we never, a lot of us hardly ever, um, oh, what's the word, think of our life and, and say, you know what, hmm, I woke up today without juice, without, um, not hungry for food without hunger, but without hunger for light to make it happen. Is this really my, my final form? And it's, uh, it's disappointing here in Los Angeles because... With... Uh, Hollywood down the street and everyone, not everyone, but a lot of people saying, yeah, I'm going to be the next model, I'm going to be a singer, I'm going to be an actor. And uh, they're serving my coffee, sucking my dick, washing my car. Um, no, I know I'm not hating on anyone that uh, pursues the wildest dreams and Puts everything, put, puts every, all their bets on one thing. Uh, I know some people. I know, let's see, one dude uh, who's an actor. He's been in TV on film. Another friend has been on TV and film. Another one that went. Uh, Shit had a really uh, tough uh, upbringing, and uh, he did many TV shows and many movies. I'm thinking about uh, th their sort of mentalities. <laughs> and I realized that. I say this with a lot of kindness and love that they're nothing special, meaning that they're simply humans that are in touch with the fucking moment, man. That, that, that is it. That is it. Yes, there are assholes that are get lucky and get it done, but you know, these guys are Superb, man. Lost my train of thought. Because, but by knowing these people, I believe, you know, if they could do that much, why can't I do just as much? Uh, I believe one has to be careful not to, not to say, uh, or think, or believe. No, well, if you could do it, I could do it, or, but in a bad way, um, think well if he has that well I deserve that too no 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 not like that but more like when you realize that 
Man, you know, you could do that much just by being yourself. It's interesting. Let me try it. Oops, it didn't work. All right, let me try again. Oops, it didn't work. All right, let me try again. Oh, man. I'll, I'll get it. I'll get it. I'll get it. I'll get it. I won't tell this dumb little bitch. Yeah, I'm going to school for acting. And I'm just serving coffee here so I could, um, you know, get a gig. And she was real, real timid. No, 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 no. I'm not fucking hating on her because she wasn't a fucking loudmouth cunt. Nope. But I can't see her as a big star actress or even on Broadway. No, why? Because I, I said something like, uh, have you been whoring yourself out? Putting your name out there? Taking every bit as possible? And when I said that, I didn't mean that in the, um, well, are you fucking doing it? No? It's, or, has your dumbass been out there? No, I just, uh, I meant it in a way of, hey, have you, have you fucking been taking every fucking shot out there, man? And I think, uh, to me, I had to do the research on Charles Bronson because uh, Jocko Willink had brought him up about his uh, tough uh, background. And uh, definitely need to uh, look him up, see if there's something on the YouTubes on him. I think whether you're cooking, engineering, welding, acting, tattooing, whatever the fuck, if you go out and explore and and learn this and that and then experience this or that new field, another field, the opposite field. I think that'll, uh, I'm trying to think of a word, dissolve, chip away from your, your ignorance on life. And you can be like, wow, I don't know that this was possible or that much was possible. getting lost in the train of thought as usual. Because so many things come to mind, man. And as I deflect more and more uh, weakness, Stupid behavior, poor behavior. Um, you know, it's even distracting for me. It gives me a headache, or even some days, some sort of heartache. I think. Damn, dude, that uh, <laughs> that motherfucker really is hopeless, or, or is really choosing to be hopeless. And uh, curiosity makes me think. I wonder why they're like that. And Jim Rohn would probably be like, well, you know what, mysteries, mysteries of the mind, move on.
again, if you're here for uh, the drawing lessons, I'm trying to think, yeah, what's, what's the formula here? Uh, good luck, because I, I don't fucking know it. Uh, uh, I li literally do this, I think. You know what? Let me see. Oh, if I keep on adding more here, will that look right? Use my imagination. Mm, you know, it looks good. Let me just blend this in here. But I'm not thinking, uh, I'm not thinking that, well, uh, this background will look so, um, impactful, <laughs> this will be genuine fan art, because it will show that the uh, Rick and Morty memory dream state with the agent, and, uh, when he was stuck at the, um, Federation, um, will justify the whatever the fuck I need the tone so it looks smooth to give it the uh, smooth uh, transition of the Rick and Morty fan base and, and I don't think that I'm not thinking that i get it done if I uh Fuck it up, I fucked it up. But the point is, don't fuck it up. Don't waste time or resources. Get it done. And I've done enough um, sketching and uh, drawing and experimentation to um, just keep at it. I think what else uh, Doug John Peterson had said. And I do tear up a bit when uh, Dr. Peterson mentions the people that come across them and say, you know, I've been listening to your lectures and I've been, uh, been organizing my life. And as my body here craves caffeine, they've got some right here, but or a drink just to drown the ego a bit. But he says, it's a, he doesn't say that it's a pain and pleasure, but for me I think that it's a pain and pleasure for him because, you know, where, where are all these motherfuckers' fathers, man? To show them, teach him that much as possible. That uh, we're all ordinary people that can do extraordinary things. <laughs> 